like I did in the last video, and the audio is kind of shaky, so I'm not going to do that. But, uh, we'll see how it goes. So, backside rerun. Whoa! Okay, that was really bad. Um, uh, I'm going to just try to, like, I'll try to heal it. Flat. I'm not gonna land it, so I, I'm very bad at heel whips. I don't know why. My brother can always heel whip flat. He's like, he's like this close to landing him, and then just falls off. Oh, we'll give it a shot. Here we go. See, I told you I'm bad. But tail whips are my thing, right here. Tail whips are definitely my thing. But. I can actually bri flip yes or <laughs> like yesterday. I can actually bri flip, so um if you go check out the video it's called Bri Air or you can go check out Bri Thug Life Edition. You can go check out Bri. You can go check out there's a lot of videos with Bri's except for my GoPro video, so once I get back out into this uh once I get back to the park, I'll be able to do that for you guys. So actually guys, what I'm going to do this video is not just get clips. I'm going to be teaching you how to tail whip. I've done this in my basic scooter trick video, but now I'm going to actually teach you on one thing. So if you haven't seen the basic scooter trick video, go check it out. It's like the 15th video I've made. I have like 130 on my channel, but you guys can watch any one of those you want. But after I get back on there, the bri air will be like this to you guys. And then I'll hopefully land it. So yeah, I'm going to be teaching you how to do a tail whip. If you want to learn how to tail catch, comment down below. I'll teach you how to tail catch. And off of bar spin. But then I'll be at the park when I teach you how to off of bar. I'm not that good at them, so when I go back to the park, I'll probably be a lot better than them. This is off of bar flat. This is how close I am. Whoa, that was very bad. I'll just try bar flat real quick. Just, I'll try throw bar first, and then I'll do bar. Here you go. That's throw bar. Do it again, just in case you didn't see. There you go. And then this is regular bar spin. There you go. I kind of caught it wrong, so I'm going to do it again. I caught it wrong again. All right, once we get this perfectly good, we'll go back and ride. So there we go. I'll count it. No, I won't because I put my foot down. So here we go. Last try. I'm counting it. So anyway, let's get into the tail whip tutorial. So the first thing you want to do is figure out which way you stand on the deck. It's either you stand goofy, regular, ski, or you stand whatever way you want, like maybe like this. I mean, I don't personally stand like that. But you guys can do whatever you want. So you want to stand like that. Um, you also want to get down your hops. When you actually do the hop, you actually want to like manual and then hop. You don't don't want to just go like this. Or when you throw the tail whip, it's not gonna come down right. So when you hop up like that, you'll be able to do it. So. Let's see if I can show you guys a tail whip first. So this is what one looks like, actually. Bang. That was good. And flip rewind. That was really bad. I'm actually getting close to them. At the park, I'm like here, here. Without the kickless or on this kickless. Whatever that just was. This is kickless. Whip rewind kickless. But... So I haven't been doing a lot of, or I have been doing a lot of bar spin motions. It's because I like doing bar spins, but whatever. Um, so you want to see, figure out which way you stand. The best way to stand on your deck to get the most like pop, you're, you should connect your shoes. Like I got this from Corey Funk, but connect your shoes like this. If you ride like this, do it this way. If you ride like this, I mean you can. I could try to up like this, but I don't ride ski. This is going to be a little weird, but I have landed on them before. 
but this is what it looks like when you ride ski. I'll show you all the way. I'll try goofy. I'll do skiing, I'll do goofy, and I'll do regular, and I'll do ski. So, here we go. This is ski first. Here we go. You got that? And I'll do regular. And I'll do goofy. If you stand goofy, that means you heel it. But I'm going to goofy tail it. So you push out instead of kicking in. So, ready? Goofy tail it. That's catchy. Um, but anyway, do so you want to do those? Oh, they're uh, regular. Ski. Ski, you can kind of go either way. Goofy, you go heel. And then you just want to get your hops down and then just practice by put one foot here if you're regular, put one foot here, put one foot across, hop, flick, catch, and drop. And then after you do that a couple times, before you initially like do the tail whip, jump. Okay, so do this thing, but as soon as you put your foot down, you want to jump with this one foot and then flip the deck around with all your weight and try to land on it. So it'll look like this. And you kind of get the feel for it. Uh, this is like a double whip, I guess. I'm not good at those, but this is what it looks like. But So that's what you need to do for a tail whip. And then the next thing you want to do... Um, is figure out, uh, like, spin your deck around like this, like a helicopter, as fast as you can, and then, like, try to catch it or whatever. I can't catch it, and my scooter's loose, so I need to fix that after the video, but let's just stop talking about stupid stuff in T2. Um, basically, hops down, stance down, flicking down rotating down and now after you get really good at the, all those steps like after you get good at this you're pretty much ready to send it um highly recommend starting off a ramp to where you have leverage but you can start flat if you would like i learned to up off a ramp first then went to flat ground and got it so this is what the tail up should look like after you've got all the steps done you first might land like this, or if you don't, if you don't get it around enough, your deck will go like this. Some people start off like that. By all means, keep practicing, and it should look like this. Or you can do catch like, like that. But yeah. Subscribe.